Hey guys, I'm back. Today's video was supposed to be a clean with me video, but unfortunately I forgot to turn on the camera. So it has turned into a decluttering video. And so I'm going to show you what the pantry looked like before I started to declutter it. And as you can see, it's uh, there's no organization and um, stuff is just everywhere. So what I did was I went through first to see the things that were expired and I got rid of those and I'll show you some of the empty boxes that I put out in a minute but um, we'll start from the top um, before we used to have cereal up on this top shelf but I kept having to help my youngest child get it so I decided to lower it to the bottom shelf and I put them in these containers and you can get these at Sam's I haven't seen them anywhere else but I love them um, so like our tea well my husband's tea is up here and I, we put the cookies up here because if we don't the kids will eat them all in one day this is usually where we have our bread and I need to get more because uh, two of our kids take lunches to school I also decided to put their lunch boxes up here because on Fridays they don't need them for the weekend and it gets them out of the way um, so these are extra lunch boxes in case they forget theirs at school. Um, this is a water uh, jug that my oldest son used to use for band, and then a dehydrator, and then part of part the silver pots up here are part of um, the fryer, which is out in the garage, I think. Up here are three baskets, and they hold wash dishcloths. Um, and dish chop, dish towels, and then and this last basket up here is where the aluminum foil and parchment paper is in there. Down here is some sandwich bags and cupcake, um, the cupcake uh, papers, the paper cupcake where you make cupcakes and bake cupcakes. I leave that alone. That's my husband's thing. And then here is usually where we have our that I decided to put all our snacks. Um, definitely need to buy more chips, but we're gonna try to get away from these kind of snacks, except for, of course, the popcorn, because we love to eat popcorn. And then I have napkins here. Really wanna get away with out having to use napkins, but we're not there yet. And then here is some um, whey protein and some collagen peptides, which is very little, so once I finish that off, I won't have that anymore. And then here is where I put the beans. Um, if you haven't bought these or made these before, this particular uh, 15 bean soup, it's delicious. Uh, there is a packet of seasoning that it comes with it. And um, once I soak them for a few hours, I cook, put them in the crock pot and then I'll add a meat to it, uh, usually sausage, but this time, um, we have a honey baked ham that I'm going to put ham in there and it's delicious and I will show you that in a um, future video if you want to see that. Um, we have oatmeal and our pancake mix and that's where we're going to have all that stuff at. Um, and this other one we have peanut butter and then a lot of the empty boxes only have one or two items in there so I converted them into this little container here and you get these at Dollar Tree and I love them. Um, I originally got them to put cans in there, but uh, these wire shelves are not as sturdy as I would like them to be. And so you'll see that in a minute where I put all our cans and then there's baking stuff here. And I decided to put all our baking items on this shelf because it was on this upper shelf and I would forget what we had for some reason. And as you can see, we have a lot of brown sugar. We have this one and this one and powdered sugar and we had like three bags of these two of them were already open and I just got rid of them down here I have another bin and this is where we put candy in and they're really cute and once I get candy put them in there I'll show you that in a future video as well um, because this is just the decluttering part of our vi of our pantry I want to add some more like shelving carts in here uh, for the baskets that are on the floor and I'll show you that in a minute um, we have a ton of Gatorade because the kids play basketball they are on teams and 
it's just cheaper for us to get it here than it is at the concession stand. And then here we have like a chopper and a slicer thing here. And then we have a mixer, which we need to get a new one because for some reason the handle is, when you use it, um, the black part of the handle gets all over your hands. It's really weird. Plus it's really old, so I think it's time to get a new one. We have our bags here. Uh, the red bag is just uh, where we put our bags from Walmart so we can recycle them. And I'll show you if that thing was overflowing. And then this container is like what we use for the cereal, but it has uh, cat food in it. And then we buy the big bag of Uncle Ben's at Sam's and we leave that there. And then it's just easier for me to put some in this container here. It's an old element, uh, Hellman's uh, plastic jar where mayonnaise comes in. Just washed it out and I keep that pretty much full so I'm not having to open that huge bag every time I want to make rice. Um, we're trying to cut back on pasta. So the only thing we have right now is this Elbow macaroni and then the cereal. And then these are the containers that we house our cans in. Um, we had three down here and then I got rid of one or I didn't need one of them because some of the stuff was expired. And then there's some canned meat that I want to get rid of as well. That's not expired. I'll probably just post on our neighborhood Facebook page and see if anybody wants it. If not, I'll donate it. And then over here, we used to use this as, um, to write like what we were having for dinner. Um, but when we moved into this house, I didn't really have a wall to put it on. Other than the pantry, and the only thing that we use it for is for our magnets, because we love magnets. Um, and I got these from Dollar Tree years ago, and I never put pictures in them. I'm not sure if I plan on doing that or just getting rid of it. Um, but that is our pantry decluttering, and this is also going to help with the grocery shopping, so I can see better now what we have, and I'm not buying multiples of stuff. As you can see, we like to make cake and we have multiples of those and we have too many honestly but I'm gonna swing you over here and show you all the stuff that we got rid of um, I am selling some items as well here is the Walmart bags that I'm getting rid of and then these are all the empty boxes that I'm getting rid of as well and then this plastic container that we no longer use um, these markers for the dry erase and the erasers where we don't ever use those and then these are all dish towels and um, hand towels for the kitchen that are super old and so I'm going to get rid of that. I am currently selling that on Facebook Marketplace and uh, in our neighborhood, um, neighborhood uh, Facebook page as well. Um, here is that canned meat that I was telling you about. We got it during the hurricane and um, we used one can and I don't like it, it's gross. I got this for free from one of the neighbors and have never used it so I'm going to give that away. We have all these straws that I need to give away as well because we don't use plastic straws anymore. I have these plastic utensils that we've never used. I got them a Dollar Tree years ago. Um, it's time to get rid of that. I'm also getting rid of this uh, George Foreman grill. Um, we had this one first, then we got the red one, and um, we just, we have too much stuff, so we're getting rid of it. We don't use it anymore. I am also selling this Instapot. Um, I don't cook that much food to begin with, um, and I don't really like it. So I'm selling that. I've used it maybe once or twice. It's just been sitting in the pantry in the corner. Um, someone is supposed to pick that up tonight, um, but we'll see. And then I also got rid of an electric kettle, and I'll post a picture of that on here. And then also six mason jars that I used to use, but I don't use them anymore. And I figured someone else could find um, a use for it. And so I sold those two to the same person. Um, but I think that's it. And I got rid of a lot of um, old food that was expired. But uh, that is what I did today. And once this video is over, there's the cat. Um, I'm going to recycle all that and put those bags in. And 
as you can see my kitchen's pretty dirty again um, but that is going to be another project for me to do and I need to figure out what to do with those shelves but this is the pantry and what it looks like so far I didn't do a deep clean I just decluttered it and swept them off the floor and that's it I do plan on coming back and doing a deep clean and labeling the baskets so I can remember what's in them and um, just to check them periodically make sure to clean them out uh, but that is it for today if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe to my channel and like this video as well uh, I hope you have a wonderful day uh, God bless and I will see you next time bye